welcome to Ecoholics. Today we are going to understand a very interesting concept related to the production possibility curve or PPC. It is the shifting and rotation of PPC. Now when I say interesting, it means that there is a fundamental concept of PPC that you all must have studied in our previous lecture. While you understand the concept of PPC, we can also shift and rotate the PPC according to the production possibilities that are available in the economy. Let's say for example that the economy uh, does not have technology up until now. So it has certain uh, basic re resources that are available in the economy and everything is done by human means or human resources. However, when we talk about initiation of technology in the economy, so what will happen that when the technology will come in the economy and everything will shift uh, up according to the technical aspects, then definitely the production possibility will gradually increase and the economy will na now have a better chance or better production possibilities to produce those two goods, right? So now let's understand about the shifting and rotation of PPC. Now we have over here two different um, factors that are associated with shifting and rotation of the PPC. The first factor is the changes in the resources, right? So whenever there are changes in the resources in the economy, there can be uh, seen that the, there's a shift in the PPC. Now let's say that we have commodity Y, good Y, right? And we have good X. And we have here origin, okay? Now, let's understand what it is. When we talk about change in resources, it means that if the resources are increased or they are decreased, what will be the impact on the economy and how the economy will now produce the same resources, uh, the same commodities. Obviously, the commodities will decrease when the resources will be limited and the commodity production will increase when the resources will be huge or humongous, right? So, first let's draw a basic PPC. This is the PPC of the economy. We say it PPC 1. This PPC resonates, showcases the given resources that are available with the economy. Now, let's say that the resources now are more. Resources can be capital, can be huge investments, can be uh, raw material, can be more industries, anything, right? So, all of these resources have expanded in the economy. And now, because we have more resources in the economy, a bigger possibility is present for the economy to have an increased amount of production for commodity X and commodity Y. So that's why we are going to shift the PPC towards right. Okay. So what does this rightward shift mean? It means that the resources have increased, right? They have increased. There's another possibility also. Let's say that certain resources are limited, okay, for the economy. Now, obviously, you would think that how can the resource be limited? Uh, we can say that gradually the economy may have a higher demand for production of different commodities. But because of the limitation of the resources, they will not be able to produce more and more commodities, right? Also, uh, vivid resources, vivid findings of resources can also play a huge role. For example, a certain excavation of uranium, okay, can cause a drastic improvement in the commodities that can be available for 
you know different purposes of research but if that uranium is not found or for example if the coal stock has deteriorated and now we do not have any more coal stock but we have high demand of production of energy and energy related commodities so what will happen then the resources now have deteriorated and so the ppc curve will shift towards the left okay this leftward shift talks about the deterioration restriction limitation of resources available with the economy it can be economy's own resources it can be economy's produced resources it can be economy's natural resources any type of resources right so that is the impact a forward shift and a backward shift that talks about the changes in the resources that will impact the ppc right so this was your first factor that impacts the shifting of pp pvc now let's talk about the next factor the next factor is change in technology now you all remember that when we talk about ppc we always talk that okay technology kept constant okay we talk uh, about the constancy of technology while we look at the ppc from a given point of time right however when we want to understand what has been the change uh, last year what was the ppc and now this year what is the ppc so obviously the time has changed the timeline has changed so we need to also understand and what is the impact of technology in this duration there can be a positive impact on technology at each commodities aspect for example there is a commodity which for which the technology has improved okay let's say for example we have a ppc okay we have a ppc this is ppc 1 which is your initial ppc okay and we have over here good x and we have over here good y right now let's say that the technology has improved for commodity x okay and for commodity y it has not improved it's still the same right because there are possibilities that the technology may change for uh, one factor at once or one variable or one commodity at once okay so now let's say that the commodity x has better technology better technology means production possibilities increased so for x the production possibility has increased but for y the production possibility still remains the same right so which is why now shifting will not happen it will be called as rotation of ppc so we will have the ppc which will look like this so initial point will be similar to the original ppc but as the commodity x expands we have a newer position of ppc for commodity x because of the increase in technology for commodity x correct same way if we talk about commodity y if we say that the technology has increased or improved for commodity y but for commodity x it has not improved as such so then what will happen we will have rotation from the other side so so let's say that we are talking about commodity y whose uh, for which the technology has improved so possibility of increasing the production of y has improved so we will not start from this position but we will have another position okay so let's say we have this position of y but we will have the same position for x okay so this is the increase in y that has taken place the rotation of ppc has happened because the technology for y has increased okay but of course there can be certain commodities for which technology has improved 
on both sides or on both hands so which is why at that time there will be a shift in the whole ppc so let's say that if technology has improved in the whole economy and it in impacts both commodities x and y so then what we can say is the ppc will shift towards the right or there will be a forward shift in the ppc because of the overall technological improvement so that's it for today's video we have understood the concept of shifting and rotation of ppc and i hope that now you know the difference between the two so stay tuned to ecoholics for understanding more such concepts of economics in the most simple manner until then goodbye